Hi, welcome to the Commercial Gas Engineer channel. I've got a site where the heating isn't getting hot enough throughout the building. So I'm checking um, actuators, especially this main actuator. We have our constant temperature circuit there that circulates throughout the plant room. And we have our VT circuit here, our variable temperature circuit. Our VT circuit comes around here. And then it makes its way. There's two pumps here. Makes its way into this pump here. You can see it's got its belts. We have our inverter here. Our inverter that is driving the pump motor. And then that in turn leaves the pumps and makes its way down. Makes its way down there on the right hand side, you can see it. That makes its way into the building, into the main building. And on the left hand side, that's the return. There's also other circuits, like one feeding the two chlorifiers, the one here and the one here on the right. And there's the temperatures up there. So I've gone around the building and I have checked certain parts and um, the ambient temperature around the rooms isn't too bad. So we're getting um, in certain parts of the building anything from a minimum of 17 Celsius up to about 22 Celsius. I believe that the minimum um, you can have in an office where people aren't doing physical work is 16 Celsius, but where people are carrying out a physical job, it's about 13 Celsius. Um, in this particular building, um, there is not much physical work going on. Um, it's more office bound, so six, 16 Celsius is the minimum, and you have 17 Celsius in one of the areas. The average temperature from the radiators, though, is um, anything from about 25 Celsius, or should I say ranges from 25 Celsius to about 45 Celsius throughout the building. There is an area where, where the radiators are just completely dead. So um, there's possibly a, a blockage on the pipework or the pump, the VT pump is not powerful enough to get the heat over to the other end of the building. The other end of the building that isn't getting hot, there are several radiators in that part of the building that are not getting warm. The area is about 17 Celsius in temperature, 17 to 18 Celsius. Um, but um, the radiators are not getting hot at all and they're the furthest end of the building. There's a dosing pot here, but I doubt that it is being used often. Um, with this dosing pot here, I think what we're going to do is um, recommend that the system get um, some chemicals put inside it and that it get a, a chemical um, dosing company in to cleanse the system. This BMS here doesn't work in a plant room, but I've looked at a BMS in an office and uh, made some adjustments to the, to the um, flow temperature range. So the flow leaving the um, plant room, I've increased the temperature on the, I've increased the flow temperature leaving the plant room so that it, the, the, all the radiators beef up in temperature and compensate the part of the building that isn't getting warm. So I've made some adjustments on my, my pump. So I have removed um, TRVs as well to ensure that the TRVs um, are that the TRVs are are loose and that they are not um, stuck.